Picture this, one drop of venom could kill 100 people. But here's the crazy part. This deadly animal has never killed anyone. You're about to discover which continent has the world's most lethal venom and why deadly doesn't always mean dangerous. By the end, you'll know which continents to fear and which ones will shock you. Here's something wild. Venom evolved on every continent except one. For millions of years, nature ran a deadly arms race. The results? Absolutely terrifying. This ranking isn't based on scary stories. I cross-referenced research from top institutions, medical journals, wildlife studies from around the world. I'm ranking by three things. How toxic the venom is, how it's delivered, and real danger to humans, not myths and fear. Some rankings will shock you. The most venomous isn't always the deadliest. The deadliest isn't always the most aggressive. Ready? Let's go from safest to most dangerous. Rank seven, Antarctica, the venom-free zone. Here's something most people don't know. Antarctica has zero venomous land animals, none. Why does this matter? It proves something incredible. Extreme cold shuts down venomous life completely. Think about it. No snakes survive below freezing year round. No scorpions, no venomous spiders. Cold acts like nature's venom blocker. But wait, there's a twist coming. Antarctic waters do have venomous creatures. Antarctic octopuses evolved venom that works in freezing water. It's found nowhere else on Earth. Here's the truth that breaks beliefs. Most people think all continents have deadly venomous animals. Antarctica proves extreme places can eliminate venom completely. Antarctica takes last place, not because it's weak, because it's too harsh for venom to exist. But as we leave the ice, venom starts to emerge. Rank six, Europe, the mild threat. Europe might surprise you. For such an old continent, it has few deadly venomous animals. The European adder wins as Europe's most venomous. But here's the thing, it's pretty mild compared to what's coming. Let me put this in perspective. The adder's venom rate's at 0.86. That sounds scary. But it's weak compared to tropical species. Here's a shocking fact. In Britain, only 14 people died from adder bites since 1876. The last death? 1975. Almost 50 years ago. Why is Europe so tame? Ancient ice ages, massive glaciers covered Europe for thousands of years. This wiped out highly venomous species. But here's what will blow your mind. Despite centuries of scary European snake stories, you're more likely to die from a bee sting than an adder bite. The European adder is like that friend who talks tough but is harmless. It'll hurt you and make you sick, but probably won't kill you. Cross the Atlantic and things get serious. Rank 5. North America, the desert assassin. North America is where venom gets real. Meet the Mojave rattlesnake. This snake doesn't mess around. Among the most toxic venoms recorded in North America and comparable to some of the world's most potent snake venoms. Here's what makes it terrifying. The Mojave has a unique poison called Mojave toxin. Most rattlesnakes cause bleeding and tissue damage. This one causes instant paralysis. The numbers? Mojave venom rates 0.23, that's incredibly strong, one of the most potent venom mixes in the world. But here's the plot twist. Despite world-class venom, the Mojave rarely kills people. Why? Because location, modern treatment, and many Mojaves have a milder venom type that's far less dangerous. The Mojave lives in remote deserts, far from cities. When someone gets bitten, hospitals have anti-venom. This keeps deaths low. Here's proof of its power. In lab tests, Mojave venom killed mice in minutes. The poison shut down their breathing instantly. Here's the belief breaker. North America's most venomous snake is more toxic than the black mamba, but location and medicine make it less deadly. The Mojave is like having a nuclear weapon in your backyard. Incredibly dangerous, but so contained it rarely causes problems. If North America has world-class venom, South America takes it further. Rank 4. South America, the eight-legged nightmare. Welcome to South America, where spiders became as deadly as snakes. Meet the Brazilian wandering spider. It holds the world record as most venomous spider, and it lives up to the hype. Here's what makes this spider terrifying. It doesn't build webs and wait. It actively hunts at night. And it's not afraid of you, the venom is incredibly strong. Lab tests show it can kill with just 0.006 milligrams. 
That's crazy potent for a spider. But here's where it gets weird. The venom causes a strange symptom in men, a painful, long-lasting erection. Scientists study this venom as a treatment for erectile problems. Let me tell you how dangerous these are. Before anti-venom in 1980, confirmed deaths did occur, mostly in children. The symptoms are brutal, extreme pain, sweating, blurred vision, fast heartbeat. In bad cases, you can't breathe. But here's good news. Since anti-venom arrived, death rates dropped to under half a percent. Out of 7,000 bites, only 10 people died. Here's the belief breaker. This spider's venom is so strong, it's being studied as medicine. Nature's deadliest toxins become tomorrow's treatments. The Brazilian wandering spider shows South America doesn't play games. Evolution goes all out here. From spider nightmares, we enter Asia's snake legends. Rank 3. Asia, the snake eater. Supreme Asia is home to legends. The King Cobra is the ultimate legend. This isn't just any snake. It's the longest venomous snake on Earth, growing up to 18 feet. That's longer than most cars. But size isn't what makes it deadly. It's the venom amount. A King Cobra injects up to 7 milliliters in one bite, enough to kill 20 people or an elephant. Here's what blows my mind about King Cobras. They're incredibly smart for snakes. Handlers report that King Cobras react differently to familiar keepers, but this hasn't been scientifically proven. They build nests for eggs. They guard those eggs like devoted parents. Picture this. When threatened, a King Cobra doesn't just hiss. It raises six feet off the ground, spreads its hood, makes a sound like a growling dog. Absolutely terrifying. But here's the fascinating part. King Cobras mainly eat other snakes, including venomous ones. Their venom kills reptiles fast. Want to see their intelligence? Researchers watched King Cobras learn keeper routines. They know feeding time. They recognize different people. That's remarkable for a reptile. The venom is a nerve poison. It shuts down your nervous system. You get droopy eyelids, slurred speech, and paralysis. Without treatment, you die from breathing failure. Here's the belief breaker. Despite its scary reputation, the King Cobra is shy and avoids humans. Most bites happen during breeding season when females guard nests. King Cobras are like the ultimate predator that doesn't want to fight you. They'd rather hunt other snakes alone. But corner one, especially a nesting female, you're in serious trouble. But Asia's King Cobra faces competition from Africa's speed demon. Rank two, Africa, the lightning strike. Africa brings us the black mamba. This snake is everything you've heard and more. The black mamba combines three deadly traits, super toxic venom, incredible speed, aggressive defense when cornered. Here are the terrifying facts. Black mambas have been reliably clocked at over 16 kilometers per hour, with some reports claiming they can reach 20, faster than you can run. They strike at chest height. They bite multiple times rapidly. The venom is a nightmare mix. It attacks your nerves and heart. Without anti-venom, nearly everyone dies. Here's how fast it works. Symptoms start in 30 minutes. You collapse in one to two hours. In bad cases, death comes in seven to 15 hours. Let me tell you about their deadly skill. There's a case where one black mamba entered a house and bit multiple people in the chaos. Almost all died within hours. Here's what makes them truly terrifying. Black mambas don't bite once and leave. When cornered, they strike over and over. Each bite delivers massive venom. The speed gets you. A black mamba strikes from six feet away instantly. Their reach and speed make escape nearly impossible. Here's something that might surprise you. The name black mamba doesn't come from skin color. They're grayish brown. The name comes from the black inside of their mouth. They show this as a final warning. Here's the belief breaker. Black mambas don't chase people long distances like myths say. They're trying to escape, often in your direction. In tight spaces, it looks like they're hunting you. The black mamba represents Africa's venom approach. Fast, efficient, absolutely lethal. Evolution's perfect killing machine. But even Africa's legendary mamba bows to our final continent. Rank 1. Australia, the venom champion. Australia takes the crown. The winner is the inland taipan, also called the fierce snake. This snake has the most toxic venom of any land snake on earth. The numbers are mind-blowing. 
the Inland Taipan's venom rates 0.025. That's 10 to 50 times stronger than most cobra venoms. It's off the charts. One bite contains enough venom to kill 100 adults. In lab conditions, the venom acts extremely fast. Prey collapses very quickly, often in under a minute. The venom is a perfect storm of nerve poison, blood clotters, and organ destroyers. But here's the incredible twist. Despite having the world's most lethal venom, the inland Taipan has never killed a human. Not one confirmed death. Why? It's incredibly shy and lives in one of Earth's most remote places. The Australian outback, specifically southwestern Queensland and northeastern South Australia. Let me describe this snake's hunting. It specializes in killing rats in burrows. When it finds a rat, it bites multiple times in under a second. The venom is so strong, the prey dies instantly. This precision is necessary. In a tight burrow, a fighting rodent could hurt the snake. So evolution created venom that works like an instant off switch. Here's proof of its power. Researchers can get up to around 100 milligrams of venom from a large taipan, enough to kill tens of thousands of mice, depending on test methods. The few people bitten were snake handlers or researchers. All survived with immediate treatment. Without anti-venom, death would be almost certain. Here's what's fascinating about behavior. Despite being called the fear snake, it's actually calm and shy. The name refers to venom, not attitude. When threatened, it coils in an S-shape and might strike if cornered. But it would rather disappear into an earth crack than fight. Here's the ultimate belief breaker. Australia's most venomous animal has never killed a human. This proves deadliest venom doesn't equal most dangerous animal. The inland Taipan represents venom evolution's peak. It's what happens when nature has millions of years to perfect a biological weapon. But it also shows the most dangerous predators aren't always the most aggressive. So there you have it. From Antarctica's venom-free landscape to Australia's biological superweapon, each continent tells a unique story. Antarctica proves extreme places can eliminate venom completely. Europe shows how ice ages limited venomous evolution. North America hides world-class toxins in remote deserts. South America created spiders as deadly as snakes. Asia built the ultimate serpent predator. Africa perfected speed and aggression. Australia evolved the most potent venom on Earth. Each continent's most venomous animal reflects its environment and history. The deadliest isn't always the most dangerous. The most feared isn't always the most lethal. Remember that opening hook? The most venomous animal that's never killed anyone. That's nature's complexity. The most extreme adaptations don't always create the biggest threats. Which continent's champion surprised you most? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I read every single one. Remember this. Understanding these creatures helps us respect and protect them. Knowledge beats fear every time. Next time someone asks about the world's most venomous animals, you'll know the truth. It's not always about the biggest or loudest. Sometimes it's about the quiet ones hiding in shadows with nature's most perfect weapons.